It is Wednesday night, and we are at the lab. This is where I go when I want to get work done. Oh, actually, here, I can do a thing. I'm here with Eric, who will be back in a minute. He is out painting a gun, I think. Oh, my own personal throne. Well, personal in that it's at the lab. He's super comfy. Sadly, it will not be here for headshots, because this is where we will be doing headshots from the heart. In fact, that's what I'm here working on. Eric is working on his costume for PAX East, which is amazing. It is going to be incredible. Let me just get a look at it here. Yeah, he's got a Planet Side 2 thing going on, so he's building all the armor. It is going to be super cool. And he's got a week to do it, because we're off to PAX East next Thursday. And I will be doing videos from Boston and from the road. Uh, it is uh, Ryan's bachelor party, so we're going to be down there, and I have a couple of surprises planned for him that I haven't told him about, on account of then they would not be surprises. But yeah, this is Quartz Lab. That is our sphere. I have no idea what it's doing there. It's some kind of simulator thing. But people here make all kinds of things. We have 3D printers, and in the other room we have a laser cutter. We have a giant shelf full of resistors and different things. That's the sound of Eric coming down the stairs. Hi. Say hello to the internet, Eric. Hi, internet. Yeah. I was showing them. I was showing off your costume. Uh, such as it is right now. Well, so the, your costume designs, rather. Yes. And the constituent parts of it. Yeah. Can you show us your gun? Uh, yes, I can actually. All right. Thank you for holding this open. Yeah, we have a we have a pretty functional machine shop. This this room is in in a month is going to look totally different because we're going to have rearranged it entirely for headshots. Uh, is... So I've done some of the priming. It needs a second coat, I think. But uh... I'm going to cross the border with this man. It's it'll be fine. I, I won't keep it like you know. I assume you're just going to be driving and leaning out the window with it. Last year when I went to PAX, I brought a gas mask and a, a much more real-looking gun. So it's been worse. Because <laughs> I think when you pull into the border and you're, you're carrying any kind of gas mask, it instantly raises suspicion. So. Fair enough. It is going to be an exciting trip across the border, which I do not get to talk at. Are you bad at talking on the border? Oh, there are rules. Rule number one, I don't talk at the border. Rules seven through 13, Jim doesn't get to talk at the border. It's important. You get nervous. No, no, I just, I, uh, I ask questions, and you're not supposed to ask questions at the border. You're supposed to answer questions at the border. That's true. We'll talk about that another day. I will see you guys tomorrow with a video about something. Maybe about things I learned at NerdFest, because I really want to do a video on that. Maybe about something else. It depends on what I get up to.